In this video, I'm going to show you how to use the frequency function in Google Sheets. The frequency function is a pretty useful function um, if you regularly do frequency distribution. What this frequency function will do is it will calculate the frequency distribution of a one column array into specified classes. So basically what this does um, is I have these classes here. This is going to be the second argument and it's going to create a distribution range from the classes that I specify in this function. So I have three classes in here and what it's going to do is then it's going to count the data set, um, the individual pieces of data that fall at or below my first class in between my first and my second class in between my second and my third class and then above my third class. So the distribution ranges that it will count will always be one above the number of classes you have because the final one will be above um, your highest class. So this is the basic syntax here. There's two arguments. There's the data argument which is the array or range containing the values that you want to count and the classes um, is the array or range that contains the classes. So I'll just use the function here to show you how it works. So the first argument is my data. So I'll input that range. Then second argument is classes. So let's see how this works. So there's one piece of data here that is one or below. So let me just highlight these so you can see where it's pulling the numbers from. So one or below. Um, now between two to five, there's four. So two to five, there is four. So let's use that same color here. Oops, not what I meant to do. between 6 and 10 there's 5 so you can see there's these 5 pieces of data here that are between 6 and 10 and then I don't have anything above 10 10 is the last value so I have 1 that is 1 or below I have 4 that are between 2 and 5 and then I have 5 which are between 6 and 10 so that is how frequency works it basically just does a frequency distribution based on the classes that you specify in the function. Uh, that's pretty much it for this. It is a pretty useful function if you're regularly doing uh, frequency distribution calculations. Just let me know in the comments if you have any questions. Thank you for watching the video. If you haven't already, make sure to hit the subscribe button. If you have any questions or content suggestions, just let me know in the comments and I'll try my best to answer everyone.